Hello everybody, what is going on? I hope you're all doing great and welcome to another video tutorial and in this one I will again be covering some Skyrim modding or rather some modding in general in Mod Organizer 2 and what I'm going to be specifically doing is explaining to you guys how you can resolve conflicts. I will be using Skyrim Special Edition as an example, uh, so let's get right into it. So the main cause of uh, most conflicts and when I say most, I really mean like 90% of the conflicts you might encounter while modding is usually the load order, which means that you didn't set up your load order correctly. Uh, what that means is usually the mods that are lower in the load order, as you can see here through the priority in Mod Organizer, they load up uh, later and uh, re uh, rewrite, yeah any or overwrite rather any previous mods that are in the load order uh, if you screw up the priorities there will be conflicts and your game will crash and one of the ways you can do this is by manually setting the pre priority by dragging and dropping in mod organizer usually it goes with uh, at least for bethesda games it's uh, bug fixes patches and mo uh, modders tools overhauls first then UI, then quests and utilities, then models, then cities, then weapons, magic, clothing, items, and everything like that. Uh, and that's pretty much it. However, what you can also do is download loot or the loot load order optimization tool. And by running it through Mod Organizer, make sure it is through Mod Organizer, it will open up and then it will detect your game, detect your uh, uh, game path and everything. And what you can do then is just, is just click on... Uh, this button here which means up which is update master list and it should uh order everything correctly keep it open and launch your game and everything should be just fine what i like to do is set it up manually and launch loot just for uh just to be sure and it usually works and that's about it i hope you guys enjoyed and i'll be seeing you in another video